Ava's Flava. I'm Ava. And on today's episode, I'm going to show you guys how to whip something together that's super duper easy and oh so delicious. <laughs> I'm going to show you guys how to make a couscous salad that is super duper easy to slap together um, and you'll love it. I promise. Um, cause some nights, you know, um, you just want to whip it up. <laughs> so let me show you how to whip it. Uh, alright, let me show you what you're gonna need. <laughs> show you what you need just in one little swoop here um <laughs> you're gonna need about half a lemon some curly parsley beautiful red smell good red onion and um seedless cucumber i have some feta cheese and some beautiful couscous which i'll talk to you about in a sec and olive oil salt and pepper and that's it okay, so first let me tell you guys about the couscous um a notorious cip Usually the couscous is on, or it is, with like uh, the rice and stuff, but if you shop down the international aisle, it's a little bit cheaper. I got this bag here, it was like $2 for this. This is pearl couscous, you could use regular. And <laughs> you could, Jeff was looking at me weird, I just tried to wink at him. You could use regular or you can use quinoa, you can use anything you want. Um, so that's what I want to tell you about the couscous and just follow the package directions on how to cook it. And what I always do, is when it's done cooking, I take the burner off the heat and then do my little towel thing. <laughs> Make sure you put a rubber band so it doesn't, well, I guess if it's off the heat. You know what I'm saying? I feel like it absorbs the rest of the liquid so it makes it nice and, um, you know. <laughs> okay, so all you're going to do is add some salt and pepper. A little bit of salt. You don't need too much because the feta cheese has, is nice and salty. I'm add our pepper here. And then give that a nice mix. Then I'm going to add probably like, start at like a tablespoon of oil. Just start small and then um, just kind of taste as you go. You don't want to overdo it. And then I'm going to add in just about half of my lime. Or sorry, lime. Um... What do we got here? A lemon. And this is perfect for summer too. This is perfect little uh, summer side dish. You can serve this cold or warm. Whoa. <laughs> Lemon's getting crazy. Okay. I'm going to do, yeah, I think I'm just going to do half the lemon. You could do a little bit more if you wanted, but you don't really need that much. And then you're just going to give this a mix around. And then let me taste it and see. Yep. Good. Perfect. And then just start adding in. The rest of your goodies and that's it. This was about half of a um, red onion. And if you're a baby like Chebo and you don't like onions, leave them out. Or red onions can be pretty harsh. Sometimes you can soak them in water for like 10 minutes. Cold water and it takes off a little bit of the onioniness. Or just use like a white onion or whatever. This is perfect. Or, like I said, if you just want to leave the red onion out but you like the color, you could use bell peppers, uh, red bell pepper in here instead. You could do Parmesan cheese. Um, just make it your own. Do whatever you want. And this is perfect served with grilled chicken. And look, and there it is. So you could slap this in the fridge and let it marinate. Of course, it's going to be even better. But there's your perfect little salad. And super easy, right? So on nights when you just feel like slapping it together. And I'm going to try a little bite. I already know it's amazing. Mmm. So yummy. That feather cheese. Double. Oh. This is when this is perfect. Look what I found thrifting today. Um. If you guys know, I love thrifting. It's my favorite thing to do. So I told Chubba this is perfect. So when dinner's great, he rings the bell. Oh wait. <laughs> oh wait, there it is. Right? Well, you know what I mean. There we go. <laughs> my faulty bell. Um, so dinner was great, so I rang the bell myself because Shelby was not going to eat this because of the onion, so it's perfect. It's all for me. Okay, I hope you guys enjoy this episode, and please
please subscribe. That would be great. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.